righty, early morning, not really that early. It's actually, <laughs> it's actually afternoon right now. It's about 12 o'clock. Welcome back. Currently looking at some vans. Uh, this one is 35, 34.5, and then you got all these rebates, which drops down 28.5. I don't qualify for like any of that, but I am looking at vans this morning. Brand new, 2019. A lot of overstock going on at these uh, these dealerships from last year's models. So I think a lot of them are trying to get them out so that they only have 2020s available. Might be able to get a good deal. I don't know. I'm taking my van in tomorrow. This is the last of the couple days before I had to uh, take a break from using the van. So I figured I can probably take it in tomorrow and see what they say. Uh, it is trash picking day. I went out this morning. I did find one item. I'll include that clip first. And let's try to find some treasure. It's pretty nice out. Finally have a day where it's a little sunny. No rain in sight. A little chilly, a little windy, but we'll make do. Let's try to find some treasure and see what's out there. Let's do it. I'm going to need to take out some of these things out of the, the trunk. But. All right, grab this guy. like that she's in there another day another Christmas tree uh, buddy so we made it into town oh, see our Christmas tree down there we made it into town I might have to get out and move that hot water heater or water tank pressure tank you know, it has like a thousand different names for it because it keeps rolling around whenever I take a turn and this wind is taking its damage, as you guys see. Got a trash can down. Alrighty. We're in town. Walgreens. I always thought about like they had the same exact thing out last week an older one this thing is rolling around so much keep that there hopefully this thing doesn't roll around too much more that's so far the only thing i found in this whole town amazing Here, hopefully, it's, yeah, it's empty. That stool's awesome. I'm gonna play the odds. Wow, look how beat up that thing is from rolling around. I'm gonna play the odds here. I don't know what this is. This is for aerobics exercise? I have no idea. This is easily my most favorite find made in India. This is by far my favorite find of the year. It's gotta be like at least 25, 30 bucks. It's 
person in their wheels. I don't understand this. This is typical college town. Everyone's still home for winter break. exciting this town always throws me for a loop because half the town I think does it in like two days and then this town or this side of town does it but it's like they split up the development where it's like this side of the street would be today and that side would be two days and then that street would be today and that street would be two days so it's like all out of whack I don't know how they managed to do that there's a trash can all the way down there I see there's nothing um, come on bud Uh, so I was looking at new vans a couple times now. Uh, my thought process really would be like, if I was to get a new van, obviously I'd get a brand new van so I know there's no problems with it. I'd get the warranty on it. Uh, and it'll last me for 60,000 miles, which would generally take me about four years to reach. And vans are, I wouldn't say they're cheap, but... You can trade in a van, I think, still get 15 grand out of it. So if you spend 15 grand on a work vehicle every four years, I think it's kind of doable in a way. I mean, that's kind of just, you know, whatever might float your boat. It's not really a, a personal vehicle. It's a, you know, a work vehicle, so you use it as a work vehicle. Uh, but if, uh, when I was looking at all the vehicles, all the vans that were for sale, the only thing that I wouldn't or I would rather have that none of them had would be the Sirius radio, but I don't really even listen to the radio that much. The only time I ever do listen to it is like if I'm going to auctions or if I go up to Scran for storage auctions, but I don't listen to it when I trash pick because it's just another distraction out here. Uh, and the other thing is none of these had these bulkheads, so I'd have to buy one myself and I'd have to get one with a door because after having two vans now with this one being solid, I need the door. I, I feel like the door would definitely help me out a lot, whether it be at the flea market or whatever, a door would definitely help. So I think we're going on to town number three now because as you see, no one even has their trash out here. So we'll be onward. Very windy. Not even joking, I just passed the guy in the red truck. This is one heck of a gate. Is this thing broken? Or? Yeah, it's broken. I say, wow, that's really cool. Like, what is. Yeah, I guess it's broken there. Yeah, past the guy in the red truck, probably five houses down every week so this house on the left is the house that threw out the capacitators 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 uh, they didn't have anything out this week so that might be doing it here for round uh, town three round three town three might be doing it all right just got out of my van and I noticed this spot so yeah, I think that's that's gotta be it. Some people said put a piece of cardboard underneath. That's actually a great idea. Don't have a piece of cardboard, do I? Guess I'll throw this underneath there. This is what the wind. This ain't gonna work. Oh, buddy. Let's see where that that thing's all the way up there. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Oh my goodness, that thing is really leaking. Holy cannoli. 
All right, all that stain there. That's gotta be what that stain is. Um, so thank you for letting me know about that. That was a great idea. I don't know why it took me so long to realize that, but uh, that's a whole issue, which who knows, maybe this van will be gone by the end of the week. Stay tuned for that. But today was a fun adventure. I have now come to conclude or a conclusion that uh, there's just so much competition in these three towns of trash picking. I ran across a guy with the red truck. I ran across another scrapper who pretty much lives, I don't know, like three miles down the road. Uh, he has junk everywhere in his front yard, all scrap metal. I always see him out there like sorting stuff. Uh, scrappers are out in full force, so it's going to get really, really hard to find a lot of stuff. Fortunately, I don't think they pick up the other stuff like the, uh, the brick brack and things like that. So whatever we find from here on out, and these three towns is just going to be a bonus, I guess, for the week. And to think that usually I used to make these videos, and the only trash picking I did was just this one day uh, when I first started YouTube, and probably for the first year. Amazing, ain't it? Uh, and those were the days when we used to fill the van. Remember that old Chevy van? That thing was a piece of junk. But that was like a death trap. That was really a death trap. Uh, we've moved on in our days, but I used to fill that thing. Oh, favorite find of the day most definitely this stool check out that I guess it's a milking stool I guess that's the actual term for it uh, if you look at the base it does look old it's like rusty it's this it's that look at this that's rusty uh, but I don't think it's old I think it's a reproduction I think it's a pottery barn thing I still think I'll get 20 or 25 for it I really like it. I don't know where I would put that. I'm standing on this gate. Somebody's going wild out here. Ah, well, yeah. Thank you guys for coming along for another adventure. Always a blast. Subscribe down below for more trash picking videos. Smack the like button if you guys enjoyed it. Let's try to get this video to 10,000 likes. And I'll catch up with you guys next time for the next adventure. And as always, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace.